nej det är ju inte alltid man kan bara spela rock and roll och ha roligt med musik. Ibland, eh, ibland behöver man ju lite utföra lite hård och lite eh, hårt arbete också. In life we can't just play music all the time. Sometimes we have to do some good hard work as well. I've been noticing that my jazz bass and my guitar are strangely attracted to each other. This has led to some awkward situations, to say the least. But then, after a couple of months, 
something beautiful happened. A baby was born. A six-string guitar-bass hybrid. Now we're all one happy family. Så det blir lite svårt att göra en live-video. Ja, det blir det ju såklart. Denna gången eh, så är vi långt ifrån varandra helt enkelt, ja. Och jag och eh, Erik, vi är ju här nere i de skånska vidorna. Ja. Bland, eh, bland rapsen. Ja. Och jobbar på vårt eget håll här. Men... Eh, Avsnitt blir det varje vecka ändå. Ja, jag tänkte, ska vi köra filmen? Uh, shine Away. Ja, men det kan vi väl göra. En, t- en liten tillbakablick, helt enkelt, på vad vi gjorde för något år sedan. Ja. ja. När jag bodde ute i skogen. Ja, det var ett trevligt tänk, men man hör ju att det är replokal. Men det är kanske är kul. Hög volym och... Hög volym och... Uh... Ett bra tryck. <laughs> Rock and roll rep precis som det ska vara. Festivalen, Helgum Blues och Rockfestival. Ja, just nu så står vi och måste ta ett beslut om vi ska försöka genomföra någonting eller om vi ska backa ur som alla andra har gjort. Men jag, jag har lite kontakt där med banden så vi kanske kan få se dem på film lite längre fram här. Yes, yes. Det är full rulla här på, på 
på arbete med festivalen. Men så får vi se om vi kan genomföra den. Ja. Helgen Blues. Helgen festivalen 2020. In previously episode, we opened the computer that you found the places for RAM and hard disk. Are we gonna change the hard disk? Like this? It's very difficult, sir. If you drink more coffee, then it gets more difficult. <laughs> because it, the hand starts to shake. It's stronger. Remove this one. This one's suspicious. Okay. I don't know what happened. To be continued next week. <laughs> Welcome everyone. For today's lesson, I'm going to talk about the difference in playing with a straight field and a shuffle field. Let me first show it to you and then I explain. Straight feel sounds like this. And for those of you who watched the latest episode where I show the warm up routine, you may notice that this was the straight feel that I used in that exercise. So, why is it called a straight feel? Well, that's because the notes are evenly spaced. A shuffle feel, on the other hand, sounds like this. So, as you can hear, it's got a little gap in between, in the middle, and the two notes are squished together. So first you play one note, and then it's got a little gap, and then you squish the two notes together and continue like that. In blues and in rock and roll music, it's very common that we use both a straight feel and a shuffle feel. So, my advice to you all is to practice them both and learn to know and to hear the difference. And also, of course, to feel the difference. Because that's the key, to feel the difference. The straight feel and the shuffle feel. Let me show you what it sounds like if we change between those two fields in the same exercise without any break. One, two, three, four. Alright, I hope I made things a little bit clearer to you and that you picked up some good information. Take care, bye bye! Ja, det är fantastiskt faktiskt. Over and out. Over and out. Yeah. Hey, hey. kommer det til at ske i næste afsnit? Erik får en gæst med i sit best program. Live vil støve af i sin blogindlæg om mundharmonika. Hvad kommer David Mund til at finde på? Kig med onsdag den 13. maj på hbswr.dk.